Check that out. El Chicano, headed to theater Cinco de Mayo weekend, and that is your super team right here. Uh, that is. Amy's got to dance. The, Amy always dances. She's got to dance. That's, that's, uh, uh, that's, uh, I think everybody should dance. <laughs> got you out of bed at 5 a.m. for this. Go out. <laughs> Welcome to American Dance Off. <laughs> All right, so uh, Joe Carnahan, I'll have you introduce the cast, the crew, the people that bring us El Chicano. Uh, this is uh, the, the lovely Amy Garcia, who you know from Lucifer, who maybe single handedly put that show back on the air. Right, we're going to be talking about that in just a minute. <laughs> got Netflix to give a huge deal, largely based on Amy uh, 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 stumping for that show. <laughs> My dear friend, Mr. Benjamin Bray Hernandez, the writer-director Hola. of uh, El Chicano. Mm. Uh, also a, a, a TV veteran, having uh, uh, directed probably every show in the Berlanti universe, uh, Arrow, Absolutely. Supergirl, mm -hmm. uh, Legends of Tomorrow, you name it. That's right. Uh, uh, Michael Stevens says shout out. Shout out to Michael Stevens. Shout out Michael to Mary. To uh, shout out to Brian Crow. Brian Crow, owner of the uh, Brian. Comedy Spot. <laughs> This guy. How are you, buddy? You should jump on there between now and May 2nd and you, 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 talk you, about you this. I'm for a little improv. Let's go, man. I'll go up there. I'll go up there and bomb for live audience. I'll watch All right. So uh, I'm not kissing butt because you guys are here. Let's step this way just a little bit. I'm not kissing butt because you guys are here, but I mean this sincerely. And I told Joe, he has a wealth of movies to be proud of. This one is among your finest work, yeah. and I think it has a lot to do with uh, entrusting one of your best buds over yeah, here. Yeah, absolutely. Benjamin, yeah. what did it mean to you, just coming from the Latin community, and also, you know, you've got a lot going on in your family that inspired this. Yeah, you know, it's, it, was, it, it all started 12 years ago, unfortunately, losing a brother to gang violence. And then, uh, as I came up into the business and, and became very close friends with Joe, my best friend, um, you know, we had an unfortunate uh, situation happened about four years ago where I lost a daughter, and Joe coming toward, you know, uh, basically having these deep conversations about being therapeutic, about writing, and, and the whole reason why I wrote in the first place with the idea when my brother passed away is more of a... Um, like it a was memoir. Just, yeah. yeah, exactly. Yeah. So, um, and then when, um, when unfortunately we lost, we, a daughter passed away, Joe really embraced the fact that maybe it was time to dedicate it not only to my brother, but also to my daughter and went to New York, had a buddy, had a place out in, uh, in the financial district, and wrote for four weeks, more of a memoir, about 185 pages, right? <laughs> Came back to uh, LA, he had a place in Palm Springs, uh, we took off and we wrote for a couple weeks, tequila shots, hugged it out, cried, and came out with these amazing 125 pages. Yeah. And now I really feel that we have this incredible voice for Latinos and Latinas. And it's really important. what I love about it, it plays like an action movie, it plays like a superhero movie, but just know that almost everything that happens in this movie is grounded in some form of reality. I love that. And Amy, for you, a leap of faith any movie is, but what made you decide to take this one? Uh, well, besides these two, I, I, I read the script and I thought, you know what, I've never read anything like this. I've been really lucky bouncing from movies and TV, and I just thought there's never really been an action movie done by this guy who's like one of the best in the business when it comes to explosions and car chases, but grounded in heart and very character driven, and never in history has there ever been an all Latino superhero movie. And I thought it was really fun and heartfelt, and I thought this has everything you would ever want in a movie, to be entertained, to cry, to laugh, to have those oh damn moments. <laughs> right. So I thought I, I really want to be a part of it. And then George is obviously such a staple in our Latin community. And uh, it was it was really a no brainer. And and Amy got him, Amy got him too. <laughs> Amy, we chased George and it was Amy that got him. Amy yeah, got Lucifer back on the air and she got George Lopez. <laughs> right, right. Let's talk about Lucifer. Where do you find time to do this? Because Lucifer never, well, you were out of production, but back into production about the time all this was coming back we together. We were, we were canceled on Fox. Dead is doornail and then we had this global uproar uh, 8.5 million people around the world hashtagged and literally saved us by Twitter saying save Lucifer they picked up our show so it's the power of social media you guys are awesome <laughs> can I ask you guys a huge favor yeah no, I, I have to go do TV but I want you to stand here and talk oh, yeah let's go taking over my Facebook hey guys hey guys what's up Hey, what's going on? Walk around. Hey, look at me. Around. Look at me. Go uh, towards the flowers. No, go towards the flowers. You guys want to take a little patriotic uh, tour? All right, let's talk to you guys about the movie. Let's talk about me. <laughs> Wait, they're they're so sweet. Let's talk about me. Okay, uh, Tracy. Oh, that's so cool. Look at that. Oh yeah, they when can, can we see it? When can we see it? Yeah. May third. May third, oh, guys. Yeah, Cinco de Mayo weekend. Cinco de Mayo weekend. weekend. Yeah. yeah, it comes out in theaters. May and, 3rd. Yeah, and uh, Michael Stevens. Hey, Joe. Michael Stevens. How are you, Michael? Linda, yeah, okay, Linda, okay, yeah. So, guys, what are you doing up at 6 a.m. asking us questions? I love this. Right, look at this. 
Yes! Oh my god, I feel like I should be very meta here. Yeah. And maybe Instagram live. If, if, Amy, if Instagram Amy goes live, if, if Amy Instagrams live on a Facebook live, it might open up a wormhole that's, <laughs> that, <laughs> that sucks it. all of. I know, isn't that great? Really I love up, it. I love it. Awesome. All, yeah. Tell us all Mark's secrets. Oh, well, you, you, you've known him forever. We have Guys, pictures. We'll, we'll talk about that have. later. Yeah. There's a Spanish word, silencio. And that's what we do when it comes to Mark's secrets. Um, uh, yeah. Well, you, um, uh, we're, you guys are really going to be... This, this oh. movie's something else, man. This movie's something else. What's that? You're going to take the kids to school. school. That's why I'm up. I love it. Uh, that's what my wife's doing asked, right now. Yeah, that's great, It's like guys. five in the morning. That's great. Yeah. Wait, hold on. Um, all right. So now Amy's going to do this. And literally, I swear we'll to God... See. The, sp- the time space continuum might split. I don't know what's gonna. I know what's gonna happen. The checking connection. It's like a dual live. Wait, now we have to go on to Amy's screen as Wait, it goes live. Wait, what does it say? Getting. Oh, oh, we're live. Oh, you're you live. Right? We're actually live. Okay, now Amy's it's live. Very, it's very meta. Now Facebook um, and Instagram face off. Is there gonna be some sort of weird? <laughs> so really like, the camera. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Right now, right now, Wait. right now, Zuckerberg's eyes just popped oh, up like Neil Brenner in Westworld. <laughs> see, we're double. Wow! We're wow. Look at see, now, look at Amy's thing. Oh, <laughs> just Jesus immediately goes. Look at, look at hearts, 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 hearts. We love you. We love you. We love you. That's oh hysterical. Oh my god! Man. That is awesome. That's crazy. We're yeah. like double, double. We're double dipping. Here. So, um, those of you, those uh, seventeen people that are still watching this, yeah. <laughs> Ben, why should these guys? Uh, why should they go see El Chicano? What are you most proud of in the film? What I'm most proud of is the fact that it's 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 a full Latino cast, full Latin cast, which is hasn't been done in over 25 years. You know, you talk about movies like American Me, Blood and Blood Out, Mi Familia, Selena. Um, it's been almost three decades, and it's time, and it's our time. Also so, directed by white guys. Also directed by white guys. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Gavachos. By the way, Blood yeah. and Blood Out. Other than is, Gregory Blood and Blood Out is, is a staple of the community. People don't yeah. realize that was directed by Taylor Hackford, who directed Officer and a Gentleman. Yeah. Right? Yeah. So, it's, it's crazy. So, so, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, now you have, you know, as Ch- being Chicano, Mexican American coming in to direct the film like this, it's all Latin cast. Yeah. Well, it's very like, grounded. Speaking story. of our album, speaking of, oh, speaking, wait a minute. Speaking of a white guy, there's Pedro. <laughs> Hello, Pedro. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for holding the camera, Joe. Yeah. Um, <laughs> the, the, by the way, Amy is also live I'm on her also Instagram. Live. I'm competing with your Instagram? Yeah. yeah. Oh, my God. No, look at this, look we're, at this we're doubling up. Oh, yeah. my gosh. That's How amazing. Look at Yeah, Amy only has 350 people as opposed to our 19. <laughs> <laughs> I get traction later. I don't get instant traction. Uh, yeah, he's She's not. got a lot of people on the know. East Coast exactly. watching right now. As soon as she got on there, it's like, heart, 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 heart. We love you, we love you, love you. What can we do? <laughs> can I tell you why that's happening? Just let's do a side-by-side. Okay, yeah. side-by-side. No. Son no, of a... Your things shit. I'll never have in life. Oh, please. Uh, so, that is great. So, you guys, a, a party pack. Six people are going to be joining us tonight for the screening of El Chicano. Wow. What should we look for? What should we... What kind of people should post in comments? Um, oh you want gosh. heartfelt stories? Do you want? Yeah, listen. I just think what, what you know. What is what's important to you? What's you know? Because listen, I think what this what this movie ultimately is to us is a labor of love, and and uh, and I've never worked harder on a film in my life, and I don't think I've ever been more proud of a movie than El Chicano. I'm deeply, deeply proud. I'm deeply proud of these guys, and the way we made that movie, which is not easy. And uh, so I think share with us your your kind of your your most the, the stuff that's most meaningful to you. You know what's most what's the most meaningful. How, what do you love and how hard do you work for those things? And tie it into La right. Familia. Make that happen because, as you know, Ben brings this from the heart. So tell us from the heart why you want to go see El Chicano tonight. And I mean it from this one. This is a guy that has one of the biggest hearts I've ever met. He attracts like-minded, kind <laughs> well, people. It's, it's about to explode with caffeine, too. So. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever it takes. Um, as much as we joke around, this movie is indelible. It's going to change your life. You need to see it. The Latin culture will be shouting around the world. Cinco de Mayo weekend. Final words, Ben Bray. Go out and see it. No, go see El Chicano. May 3rd, it comes out. Sick of the Bio Week and support the Latino community. It's a beautiful story and it's got a universal message out there, so please. Amy, what can we expect from Lucifer? Oh my gosh, just pure, uh, gosh, this is putting me on the spot. Um, You can expect a lot of sex, drugs, and uh, rock and roll, and um, you may see more of Tom and I than you did on Fox, because we're in Netflix. Do share the dirtiest details. (laughs) Joe, my friend, we'll see you guys. Uh, Extra Butter, big half hour special this weekend celebrating El Chicano. These guys, give yourselves a big round of applause. Peace out. Hey, thank you so much for watching. Be sure and subscribe, turn on your notifications, and click right here to see more awesome videos. Do it right now. Popcorn for each time. More?
Keep clicking. Good job.